Hi, and welcome back to the channel. I am your host, Clifton 3 d and last night, a trailer dropped from Netflix for the new and upcoming series, Avatar The Last Airbender. Now, this is a live action. I have my thoughts, but before we do that, let's go ahead and check out the trailer. Time. Sojourn's Comet. Time is a funny thing. The past. Oh, wow. Okay. That looks pretty cool. The globe in the ice. Nice. The future. Mm. All right, so the future. Katara looks all right. Look, maybe just a tad bit too young. Soka, on the other hand, I don't have any issues with him looking like this. Now, Soka in the in, in the animated Avatar is very characterized you know he's like very goofy i hope that they're able to capture him let's continue it all gets mixed up oh, this looks cool uh, I, <clears throat> it's uh it's it's always kind of funny to see a, a bald actor but i mean generally i don't i don't have an issue although with his scar if you take a good look at his scar there on the eye in in the show it encompasses his entire ear but i mean this is a this is a teaser so they may still fix things and and i think you know because it was a burn scar it doesn't really come across as a burn scar. It doesn't look, you know, quite as ugh, as it did in the the animated show. Oh, Uncle Iroh looks absolutely fantastic. Man. Hey, yeah. Uh, I mean, isn't that isn't that the guy from Star Wars from from the the Mandalorian, the pilot. Wow. Okay, I I'm interested to see how they uh, how they would do that. You know, from turn. I mean, guy playing in Mandalorian has a belly. Now, of course, Uncle Iroh. You know, is not really. You know, he has a belly, but later on, he gets. Fit. Hmm. There's only one way. Ooh. So the clothing absolutely fits. Looks great. I, I like the actor. And I think he fits. I think he fits for the role of the Fire Nation's uh emperor. Yeah. You keep it. Ooh. The Koshi Warriors. That looks beautiful. Wow. I like it. It's strict. Nice. Oh man, that looks like a one-to-one -one oh, shot, no doesn't it almost? Are. Looks all right. Looks better than the other actor. Ooh, the fighting looks real. I like the glow. That was good. Uh, uh, damn. All right. 
this is still a teaser. I have to remember that, but that looked, uh, you can tell that they're filming on a green screen and he doesn't know where to look. Uh, he is a young boy. He is a young boy. It, it worries me a little bit that, you know, because so far it looks great. But the actors are very young. Some, I mean, at least those three, very young, especially Aang. Hope that the acting is up par. I like it. I'm not really sure how what I think about this epic avatar the you know th this whole epic I I don't know. I guess it's all right. I I heard someone say something about, you know, being a mix of avatar and and um Game of Thrones. I don't necessarily need that. But in general it doesn't look bad. All right, so watching this teaser trailer, now we keep in mind it is a teaser trailer. I enjoyed everything in it. It looks good. It looks like the actors fit a hell of a lot better than the live action movie we got a couple of years ago. Not a fan of that, not at all, but I am a fan of the animated series. Now, there are some things going on, you know, you can tell he's there on a green screen. He doesn't really know where to look. Maybe that's something that they're still be able to fix in the post production. I'm hoping so, but generally everything I saw, I liked and I'm looking forward to this, which kind of scares me because this is Netflix. This is a live adaptation of an animated series. And you know, Netflix is kind of hit and miss. Now we did get um, One Piece, and I keep going back to the One Piece, but One Piece had the creator, Oda, sign off on everything that was made for the show. Now here we have an issue. The showrunners of the Avatar series jumped off before, you know, jumped off i'm not entirely sure when it happened but they jumped off of the project they're no longer there the claim was something about uh creative differences now this could be a good thing this could also not be a good thing it could be that netflix wants to turn this into some woke nonsense bullshit and that's why the creators jumped off. However, you can't forget that these creators are the same creators that also made Korra and brought in all the woke shit into that. So them jumping off, maybe Netflix is like, we want to make a true adaptation of the show. And they were like, no, no, let's build stuff in. That's not in there. I don't know. I don't know. I can only speculate. I'm not entirely sure, but what I can say for sure is that this live action adaptation looks a thousand times better than the movie that we got. Thank the Lord. Is it going to be good? I don't know. I am looking forward to getting more information. I'm looking forward to getting more trailers, more content about this. It's a series, so I hope that they do this whole thing justice. I'm not entirely sure. Now, I have a few things that I would like to ask you. First off, breaking the trailer down like this. It definitely helps for me not to get some kind of a copyright issue. Now, usually, you know, with Netflix and stuff like that, if I if I play the whole trailer, all I will get is that they're saying, hey. You can use this material, you just can't monetize it, which my videos aren't being monetized at the moment anyway, but going forward, you know, my videos would at some point possibly, hopefully be monetized. 
and I have to find ways to break these videos up, these trailers up. So let me know if this was okay, like stopping it from time to time and giving my three cents during the trailer. And I'm not entirely sure. Let me know what you thought about that. But also down in the comments below, let me know what you thought of this teaser trailer. Are you looking forward to the Avatar mo uh, movie? Are you looking forward to the Avatar show? Let me know. I would be interested. I, I, I think I want to cover this one. I do. I do genuinely want to cover this one now. It's Netflix, so it's probably going to be a binge model, which means it's so hard to, to actually make videos about it because when it all drops at once, it's like, uh, okay, I guess I'm just going to watch it all at once and then make a full video on it instead of episode-wise. Let me know if you're interested in that. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that like button, consider subscribing and hitting the bell for notifications. All right, until next time, take care.